What up? What's good? Real yeah. quick, um, found this groove, and this is short groove, maybe a minute, minute and a half, and um, I have it looped. Um, I'm gonna play, start out playing basic, um, just the very basic notes. I'm not gonna add anything or whatever. Um, when you play the basic notes for your bass players, um, just or uh, uh, just learning. Um, even though you're playing the basic notes, make sure your notes are clear. All right, here we go. So, just a basic bass line. Make sure your notes are clear. So that was basic, and that's enough to keep any job if you're a bass player. Just playing like the record, playing the basic notes, making sure you hit the correct notes. Um, like I said, it's enough to keep any job, all right? So um, as a bass player, this is my opinion, rule for myself. Uh, no matter what you play, if it's a bass line song or whatever, you got to have at least four ways to play it. Um, when they go to the bridge or the chorus, you got to have four ways to play the chorus, about four ways to play the bridge, um, the vamp, four ways to play everything. All right. So I'm going to do another bass line. We're going to add a little more. Here we go. Making sure your notes is clear. All right. So when I do, um, I hit that five and then go to the one. So that five is a passing tone. Bum. Instead of just straight to the one, you can use passing tones. is a percussion ish instrument so it's like almost as if you're playing drums bop, bop. Bop, bop. Bop. so I just mute that and then hit the note it's another way to do it Step. 
So hold step back and hit that four. So we're gonna do another bass line. I don't have any idea what I'm gonna do, but here we go. So this time um, I'm going to do the bass line, but do things to catch you off guard. All right. You think I'm going to do the bass line, but I'm going to pull out some stuff that catches you off guard. Here we go. catch you off guard um, and I'll explain what I'm doing after. Um, I kind of messed that up, but that's what you call 30 second note burst. So if you're a bass player, you should learn how to read drum music. You should know what a, a, a whole note is, a half note is, a quarter note is, an eighth note is, 16th note, 32 note, 64 note. You should know what all those notes are and as well as the rest, all right? Um, learning how to read music helps, all right? So. I'll do it again. Uh, I was doing the fast runs called 30 second note burst, all right? And then you got what you call triplets.
triplets. So, 30 second note burst, and then you got your triplets. I used to be in awe when people did triplets, but 30 second note burst is a whole nother level. Wow, yeah, video's too long. Peace. Hope you can use that. <laughs>